Hey guys, so I just wanted to briefly send a recap of everything from yesterday because I forgot to end the vlog. I kind of took a few little video clips of kind of um, what we were doing in class and so basically we went through a lot of information yesterday we did a lot of EKG stuff towards the end and um, she gave us homework yesterday to basically go and start this scoring course on sleep ISR, which is Interscore Reliability through the AASM. And um, it's basically like learning how to score sleep studies. So we were supposed to do the pretest, which kind of gauges um, gauges your knowledge. Sorry, my mind was totally blank there for a second. Gauges your knowledge on sleep scoring and um, gets an idea of like where you might need improvements. And so I did really horrible on the pretest. I got a fifty-two percent which I guess is good if you consider that like I haven't really been scoring anything during the time that I've been working in the sleep center. Like I've only really been scoring wake and um, none of the other stages of sleep. Oh my gosh. Um, but anyways, um, other than that, I did that before I left work yesterday because I was here till 5.30. And then today um, I need to do the EKG homework that she gave us because I didn't really have time to do it at work last night before I left it because it was a lot. Um, basically like interpreting a couple of different AV block rhythms. So um, like I had started it, but I knew I wasn't gonna have time to finish it. So I decided I'll just restart it this morning because you can't really like save your progress and start from where you left off. Um, so yeah, I figured I would just restart it. I brought my little EKG book and the notes that I took yesterday. And I don't really know what we're covering today. I know we're covering like seven more chapters. We did, I can't remember if we did six or seven yesterday. I wanna say we did seven. Um, but yeah, we got done a little bit early yesterday. We got done right around four o'clock, so I had um, about an hour and a half that I was able to work on things before I left work yesterday. And then I also like had to do some stuff for work. Um, that made no sense. But yeah, anyways, I just thought that I would recap that for you guys since I forgot to come and vlog um, like and let you guys know how it went before I went home. I did not want to work on any homework last night when I went home, so that's why I didn't do any sort of EKG interpretation homework at home. I decided to just do it this morning before um, class. So anyways, um, oh, I should also say like on the first exam, I scored 100% and I've been beating myself up about the second exam. Yesterday's exam, I got 95% because I was going too fast and not reading like the whole answers so like there were two answers that started with common and I just picked the first one that I saw because I wasn't really reading through them and of course I picked the wrong one so there were two options one was common mode and the other one was common ground and the correct answer was common ground but I chose common mode because like I said I wasn't really paying attention to what I was clicking on so I will definitely be taking my time today doing the exam today um because otherwise I would have had 100% on yesterday's exam too which is kind of frustrating and also surprising because there were math questions and I got all the math questions correct and for those of you who don't know I have a learning disability in math so I was very surprised to see that I got all of the math questions <laughs> correct um but anyways I am going to go inside because I have to do some tracking down of some nocturnal pulse oximetry devices 
and go check the mail to see if one of our home sleep tests came back that was supposed to be getting mailed back to us. So um, I need to go check and see if those are there before I can start working on my EKG homework. So I better go inside. We refer to the pressure sensor with an obstructive apnea. We look at the thermal sensor. Um, we want that sensor to decrease by 90%.